Hello everybody and welcome to T-Mobile G1 app and today I have three apps for you it's for me to review for you today okay the first app is going to be Google's goggles what this app basically does here I, I just up uninstalled and uploaded again so you can see what it's all about it says use pictures to search the web and then I just say take pictures of blah 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 take pictures of those and they'll figure out what all that means <clears throat> and then it's continue and don't take pictures of those because it won't figure it out okay So if we continue, I can enable or disable search history. I'm gonna disable it. Get started. And what this, what's interesting about this, is that I can figure out what things are. So I hopefully take this speaker. And hopefully it'll work. Hopefully take this speaker. Hold on a sec. Take a picture of it. analyzes it and it couldn't find it so yeah but it works trust me it's just not the right thing here I can take pictures of a lot of things so yeah and it, I, it tells me where things are like just give it a second I guess here see it points me directly to where things are as you see on the bottom here it tells me where everything is so and if I just tap it, it'll bring me to it. Look at things about it. More information. Bring me to the browser. I can get directions to it. Just tap directions. And this will bring me to something where I'm telling you about. What I'm always gonna up tell you about maps. So here's maps now. Here's the new maps. Okay. This is maps. This is the thing I wanted to bring you into. So let me turn up the volume. So as you see here, it tells me things. Oh, tell me my address. So that's pretty good. Okay. So see, tells me things. And then if I just go, I can go tap into Street View. Look at the directions for it. It's very simple and very easy to use. I like how Google did with this. I can zoom in, zoom out, basically like a map. Or I can just exit navigation by clicking menu and tapping exit navigation. I can still read my text messages and all this. So yeah. So that was Google Navigate Google Map. Let me bring you some more information about Google Maps. So let's zoom out here a little bit. As you see, I have that layer on, regular map layer on. It comes pre installed with that layer on. As you see. I'm pre install with that layer on. So yeah. I can simply go back like that and just go to my home. The, oh, sorry. The last app I want to tell y'all about today is it's it's Facebook. It's the new Facebook they got. You see it's a new layout from the beginning. You have your news feed, your friends, your photos, take photo, profile, and notifications. And then 
I just tap one of them. It'll, like I put tap my news feeds. I have all my news feeds ready for us to view today. Like that. I can use the touch screen. I just don't want to. I can tap older posts or click older posts like I'm doing right now. It'll bring me up to all of it. If I just either hit the back arrow or tap menu and tap home, it'll bring me back to that. So if we go to profile, it'll bring up everything. All my comments, all my videos, all that stuff. Information. Photos. If I wanted my photos. With that. And if I really want something, I can take a picture of it. Something. Let's just take a picture of any random thing like that. It'll bring me to the camera. I can retake it. Okay. Or cancel. Cancel it. And. Friends. It'll bring you up all your friends. Like have an endless scroll of friends here. Okay. I need that W. Oops. See? It's endless. So yeah. Just tap on a random pick thing. We just tap that. It'll bring me up her wall. If I tap info, bring me her info. If I tap photos, it'll bring me her photos. So yeah. I can tap everyone. It'll bring me up all my groups. But yeah. So everything just works great around here. It's perfect how you would want it to be so yeah I would recommend you go get goggles if you like just searching things like barcodes and pictures and all that if you haven't already get the new map so you don't have to keep looking at your phone all the time to try to figure out where you're going just like the droid and I would definitely recommend you to upgrade to the new Facebook free because it's just a cool new experience it's way better it's just it's just amazing so thank you and tune in next week on next time on T-Mobile G1 apps. Bye.